Western, Western Michigan, Michigan is ready to open this one up as they line up for the opening kick. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The quarterback brings his troops out onto the field for the first drive of the game. And they make the stop at the 26. Second down and nine to go. Ball on the 26. forward to about the 26. Maybe a yard on the run by the tailback. He had nowhere to go with the football. It's away and it's a booming punt. The Broncos and their ground game's always been sensational. It's not always one guy, Herbie. Sometimes they've got two or three that can carry the load. And that's what makes it so tough for this defense is you're not focusing in on just one guy. You're focusing in on really an entire scheme. And because of that diversity, I think it makes it more of a challenge. And you got to be better tacklers. Throws back across his body, and this one's intercepted. He's tackled around the 49-yard line. Good job to pick that ball off. He did a great job at getting in that passing lane and coming away with the ball. We've got a first and ten. Ball on the 49. There he goes. And he's tackled after positive yardage. That brings him second and five. Two times, two times. Four down, four down. Mike 51, Mike 51. First down grab by the receiver. Tackle made around the 33-yard line. Nice pickup as they connect on the pass play. But they look to be in sync right now. They're both reading the defense properly, and the result is a nice game. Easy, easy. Makes it on to about the 23. First and 10. Ball on the 23. Bring him down at about the 15 yard line. enough for the first. He got seven, but it looked like for a second he could have broken it for even more. Good call. First and goal. Ball on the eight. And he's taken down at the five-yard line. And this is the eighth play drive. Four down, four down. Mike 51, Mike 51. Red two, and go! Run, 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 run! Hands off to the left, and they wrestle him down behind the line. Loss of four yards on the play. That, that makes, makes it third and goal. goal. It's third down. They need eight yards here to get the ball in the end zone. Sets up a screen. Tailback's got it. And he tackles him hard at the one. Gain of nine yards. 
That brings up fourth and goal. Roger, Roger. 51, Mike. Mike, 51. Everybody bunched up tight defensively. And so now the ball's turned over on downs. The offense tried to run right by him with the counter play, but the defense was there to make the stop. Great hold, guys. This is a fun game, and I think we're going to see a lot of interesting football before it's over. Set. Blue 19. Blue 19. Check, check. Alert. And he's tackled around the six-yard line. That's a D2. That makes it second and eight. Second and eight. Ball on the six-yard line. Down right around the 16 yard line. Here we go. Here's the throw. I don't think he got anything on that. Second down, eight yards to go. Ball on the 19. where the defense has to be very frustrated there. They did everything. They got to the quarterback. In fact, it looked like they had a chance to bring him down for the sack. Somehow, he's able to throw the ball away. Ready, Quick strike to the receiver. And down he goes at the 26-yard line. The punting team's got to give their kickers some time. He really got a hold of that one. Tackle, the 37-yard line. You gotta wonder right now which offense is gonna open this thing up a little bit. I think the answer will be which offensive coordinator is willing to take a chance or two to try to open some plays up. Because right now, not only are they losing up front, but they're really not testing the defense downfield at all. Every drive's important in a tie game. I look for both sides to come out with some urgency. Now he's going to run and watch out. And he's level at the 45. Oh, eight yards. That makes it second and two. We played one. Now this one's scoreless. And we welcome you back to the action here. Just about set to start the second quarter. Four down, four down. Go, Mike. Mike Go, four. Three and eight. Go. Tackle at the 46. Call it a gain of one yard. Bring up third and inches. It's third down, and they're about the length of the football away from the first down marker. Mike 51, Mike 51. Red 2, blue 20. Motion, motion, motion. Go. Run down after a nice run up the middle. Down and he's going to get sacked. Boy, this pass rush is sometimes scary. They're really getting after the quarterback now. That brings up second and 13. So that sack sets them back a little bit now. They're looking at second and 13. Gets out to around the 38. That's not everyday speed you're talking about with this guy. This is a unique burst combined with a really impressive field vision. A one-yard gain by the halfback. That's a gain 
gain of one on the play. That brings up second and nine. Second and nine coming up here. Ball on the 37 yard line. Four down, four down. Mike, Mike, hit it. Black, Mike. I got it, I got it. He's taken down right around the 28 yard line. Here's the eighth play of the series. One yard loss for the halfback. That'll bring up second and 11. Second down and 11. Ball on the 29 yard line. Almost picked off. And I don't know if this quarterback misread the defense or just made a poor decision, but that wasn't a pass he should have thrown. Here's play number 10 on the drive. 51, Mike. Quick strike to the back, and he drops it. That'll bring up fifth and long. And we should be seeing the kicker here. Good stand by the defense to keep them out of the end zone on this drive. It's fourth down. So the kicker comes out. He'll try to put three points on the board. He gets it up, and it's good. like they're ready for the kick. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. I just love to watch this defense play. They've been flying all over the field today, making big play after big play. The crazy thing is, we still have such a close game despite how well they play. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Pulls it in, and he's in the open field. He goes out of bounds at the 33-yard line. Gain of eight yards. That makes it second and two. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. Three down, three down. Here we go. And he's hit before he can go anywhere. They spread the field in the gun with five wide receivers. Set! Great run! He wants it all going long. Boy, a golden opportunity missed by the defense. That was a sure interception only to be dropped. It's second and ten. Ball on the 48. Ready! Hot! 180! One! And the halfback's got nowhere to go. Throws quickly back to the tight end. He's at the 40. And they make the stop right around the 32-yard line. Call it again. That makes it first and 10. And there's two minutes remaining in the half. Watch two. Nice, nice, sweetheart. Let's go! They'll give it off here, and he hits him hard at the 31-yard line. Pick up of a yard for the tailback. The safety came up from the secondary and made a nice, solid tackle. Get down, get down, get down. And he throws it away. The defense got some pressure and forced a bad pass. I think they've been a little bit more aggressive here with their pass rush, and that time it paid off with an incompletion. And this play is number eight on the drive. 
Here we go. Three. Right. Caught out in the open. Western Michigan will take their first time out of the half. First and ten. Ball on the 15. Good job by the offensive line to pick up the linebacker on the blitz. That gave the quarterback enough time to find his man for a Quick throw, caught, touchdown. How about the tight end? This guy can play some football. You bet he can. He's such an all-around player. He's just as good at blocking as he is at catching the football. And he tacks on the extra point. A nine-play, 75-yard drive, and they put up seven points. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. He really got a hold of that kick. And they can forget about returning this one. Both offenses have played it pretty close to the best so far in this one. Yeah, because they've been so conservative, it's made it pretty easy for both of these defenses to be pretty dominant. Let's see an offense open it up and take a few chances. There hasn't been too much daylight between these two teams. In games like this, some players try to press too much, and that can cause mistakes. Scrambling around. Wisconsin's going to use their first time out of the half here. From their own 26-yard line. Second down. Caught, and he's hit immediately. They didn't have much of a chance on that play. Boy, this defense has a lot of speed. They're all over him by the time he caught the ball. Green nine, green nine. He's tackled around the 42-yard line. From their own 42-yard line, it's first down. Zips it to the tight end, and he is drilled at the 46-yard line. It's a great job here by the quarterback of recognizing the outside linebacker blitz and delivering the football for a first down. He's scrambling. That's a great tackle at the 28-yard line. He's going to try and scramble. Tackle made right around the 26-yard line. Kill, kill. He scrambled. Decides to tuck it in, and he's got space. Slides down to the ground. Hey, sometimes the defense does everything right, and they still lose. That time they had tight coverage, which left no options other than for the quarterback to take off. Third trip now into the red zone. Fires quickly, and he's got his receiver for the touchdown. Nice catch by the receiver for the touchdown. Anytime you're near the red zone, you got to keep an eye for this guy. They love going to him down here. Trying to go up by three, they'll kick the extra point. And he converts the extra point. Wisconsin, kick this one off. Sends it sailing downfield. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The Broncos know, I think, that at some point they just have to do what they do, even if it's not working right now. If they can get it going in the second half, it should really improve the ball game and the offense. Well, the offensive line, I think, also has to be accountable here. Uh, we look so much to our star players, and we always want them to put up big numbers. But to me, the two go hand in hand. When a running back's going to have a great game, the offensive line deserves some credit. When a running back's struggling, you've got to look at that offensive line and say, fellas, you've got to help me out. We're not going to change or deviate from this game plan. We need to be able to change this game. Picked off. It's the ball hawking senior.
Low scoring first half of play, but a close game. Wisconsin's got a three point lead. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. This is Davis, David Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. Defense has been in total control in the first half, and you'd think maybe the offense's confidence was shaken. But if you want to look at the entire team picture, David, how big a deal is it for an offense to know, look, if we can just put together one, maybe two good scoring drives, our defense has got our back. Well, a lot of times when you know you have a defense, it's great, too, is you build your offense around it. And when I say that, why do I need to take chances? You know, if it's third and long, I don't mind throwing a five-yard pass, and if I break a tackle, I get a first down. I mean, don't put my defense that's dominant, that's great, in a bad position, and, and you can afford to be more conservative. You see it every single year. What do we always talk about here at ESPN? We talk about you, you defense wins championships, and that's how you win ball games, and you see it consistently unfold. So if I'm building an offense, let's just not put my great dominant defense in a bad position. Just about time to start the second half. What, what do you think Herb Street's first point of analysis will be? Uh, I don't know, something to do with quarterback play, I'm sure. I mean, we always got to hear that stuff all the time. It's all about the quarterbacks. Brad and Kirk ready for the second half. All right, Reese and David, thanks, guys. Second half action just about ready to start here. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Boy, this has been a fun game to watch, going back and forth and back and forth. It's almost like watching a tennis match here. Whoever has the ball last, my guess, will be the team that wins it. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense, as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. Give to the running back, and he's going to lose yardage. And he was pretty much stuffed on that run. You know what? That was just a nice job by the defense in stopping him before he could get going and build up momentum. From their own 24-yard line, it's second down. He's got it out to his tight end. And he'll bring him down at the 28. That back's green, and he dropped it. Oh, excellent punt. He's out to the 30, and he's tackled at the 35. We're about set to start things up again. Wisconsin holds a field goal lead. And he's tackled after positive yardage. It's second down, five to go. Ball on their own 40. They get three yards on the play. Wasn't a huge gain here, but at least you know as a quarterback that when you throw to this senior, you're putting the ball into some sure hands. Here's a handoff, left side. He makes it out to maybe the 46-yard line. On their own 46 yard line. First down. Now he tries to buy some time. Quarterback's going to run it and he's got room to work. Brought down at the 43 yard line. around the corner knocked out of bounds at the 29 yard line and that's their third first down of the drive the defense needs to figure out a way to stop them or else they're going to have no problem putting points on the board from the 29 yard line first down and 
he tackles him hard at the 17. Here's an opening. Touchdown, Badgers. He got the handoff and knew exactly what to do with it. They like the fact that they have a halfback who can pick his way so well through defenses. And he hits the PAT. A seven-play, 65-yard drive, and it's good for seven points. Brad, that's one of those drives that can just tear your heart out. That can really demoralize a defense when they drive the ball down the field, and a lot of the yards came on the ground. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. So the Badgers continue to get it done on the defensive side of the football, Kirk. Yeah, they've done a good job of building this lead and almost determined here to protect it. Let's see if they can hold on here for the rest of the way. The offense will be hoping for a little more success than they had the last time out. Down two possessions. This offense has to step up and capitalize on this possession. Give to the tailback. He has some room. He's at midfield, and he's taken down at the 44-yard line. This is a team that knows when and how to attack on the ground. They have a very good sense for what plays will work when. First down and 10 to go after the big gain on the run. Three down, three down. Check 59. Mike, Mike is 59. There's a strike complete. There he goes. He's taken down at the 30. That's a gain of 14 yards on the play. First down. Man left, man left. Three down, three down. Check 59. Mike, Mike. Here we go. Green nine. Check, check. Two. Takes it right, and he can't get back to the line of scrimmage. From the 31-yard line, second down. Fires quickly to the tight end. That makes it first and ten. Three down, three down. Check 59, Mike. Mike Ready, 59. Ride, 69. And he's level at the ten. Hard gain of eight yards. That makes it second and two. So it's second down and about two yards to go. Three down, three down. 22, 22, eyes on 22. Ready! Ah! Tackle at the two. When you're running the ball for big chunks of yards like that, you've got something working. That makes it first and goal. Set! Green 90! Fires quick out to the receiver and he can't make the grab. They're at the two. Second down. Touchdown, Broncos. Here's the extra point to draw within three points. And he adds the extra point. Western Michigan lines up for the kickoff. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The Broncos have really surprised everybody in this football game. They have not been intimidated at all, which is great to see. The attitude and effort of this team has put them in a position where they got a shot to win this game here in the second half. 
And offense is back on the field after running the ball very well on their last drive. This offensive line really opened up some big gaps for the running back last time. And down he goes at the 40. From their own 40-yard line, it's first down. Wisconsin has a three-point lead. He's on the run. A five-yard quarterback scramble. Short yardage situation check here. It's third and one. Hang on tight, folks. We head to the fourth quarter in what could be a shocker. Wisconsin's got a three-point lead. Back in this very pivotal fourth quarter. Now well, the defense didn't surrender much room there, but the run was still enough for the first down. From the 49-yard line, first down. Gets to about the 47-yard line. forward to about the 46. A one-yard gain by the halfback. That makes it third They'll line it up again on third down. Wisconsin is up by three. Gets it out quickly to the 20. Touchdown, Wisconsin. And he tacks on the extra point. They line up to kick this one away. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. This is my kind of game. We're getting a chance to see so many touchdowns. I just wonder if this offense can continue the flow that we've seen from the previous three series. So now both teams come trotting back out onto the field. And they make the stop at about the 33-yard line. That makes it second. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. Gets out to around the 48. That's good for a gain of 19 yards. First down. And they're going to put six DBs on the field to counter that five receiver look. Slings it. I like that they're completing these underneath routes because pretty soon the defense is going to start to cheat up. And that's when the quarterback will have his chance to go over the top for the big play. They're about four yards away here on second down. Five wide. Get up. Get up. 
quick pass. He's tackled around the 13-yard line. Number 44 makes the tackle at the 13-yard line. They'll spread the field here. Let's see what the defense does with a five-wide outlook. Fires quickly. Touchdown. The draw within a field goal. He makes the PAT. A five-play, 74-yard drive. And they add seven points to the scoreboard. Fred, I thought the offense did a really nice job of mixing up the play calling on that drive. I thought the defense was on its heels most of the drive because of the versatility of the offense. So the score now. 24-21. Both these defensive coordinators have got to be going crazy right now. We've had four straight possessions in which these offenses have put points on the board. Things aren't tied, but they might as well be. It's this drive that could really dictate the tone for the last quarter. Just under three to go in regulation. Tackle made around the 24-yard line. That is a loss of one yard. That'll bring up second and 11. Second down and 11. Ball on their own 24. Four down, four down. Watch nine, watch nine. Red, two, 51, five, seven. Seven. 51. Go! run to the outside. Western Michigan just took their first time out from their own 30-yard line. Third down. Red two. Yellow three. And he's hit immediately. Well, on third down, we expected them to go to the air, and they did just that, picking up the first down. He's got the corner. Makes it out to about the 46. Great job by the running back, and that's a gain of nine. Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. They bring him down in the backfield. So they wrapped him up before he could get anything going. Yeah, there was nothing there on that option. That'll make it 35. around the corner. Well, a lot of frustration by that offense, but you've got to give the defense credit for coming up with a stop in this quarter in a game this close. Just over a minute in the fourth quarter. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The Broncos coaching staff and the entire team knows that this is the guy that can win it for them. The offense has to find a way to get the football into the hands of this running back, whether it's a, a simple toss sweep or maybe a ball out of the backfield where he can catch it in space. Any way that they can get the football to him to see if he can spring one to maybe get the field goal range, or who knows, maybe take it to the house. He lets it fly. He's at the 40. He steps up and makes a big turnover. Yeah, he just made a huge play right there. He knew what was coming all along. see the quarterback take a knee right here, winding down the rest of this clock. Takes a knee.
And the ball game's over. So the Badgers come out on top. 24-21. For EA Sports and Kirk Herbstreit, this is Brad Nessler saying thanks for tuning in. We'll see you next time.